Hello everyone and welcome back to a quest bound. As you can see, I'm back here in the uh, bar, Barry Punch's bar, and I'm he back here for a very specific reason. This is because Equestria Bound has updated with version 1.4, and one of the changes of this version is... A much nicer Moon Hatton team. So yeah, this is basically what it was supposed to sound like, just that the emulator that I'm using uh, wasn't very compatible with it. Well, version 1.4 also has many other changes, uh, you can read up on them, I'll be going on the link in the description, and uh, yeah, so basically... I just wanted to show the proper Moon Hat and music that I was supposed to play back a few videos ago. Anyway, going back to the main game now. Huh. This is not... <laughs> this is not the save file I had. Okay, thankfully I can load save state uh, <laughs> back to where I was with the scoots, but... I was kind of concerned because uh, reloading from a safe state after a version change can uh, have some disastrous effects. Thankfully, uh, none are quite apparent so far. Anyway, you all voted that I order some pizza, and I, so I shall. In three minutes. Hopefully it won't cost too much. Anyway, yeah, basically uh, the pizza is now actually worth calling for now. And for some reason I thought the music was glitched, but it's actually... It is it is supposed to be Big Brother Best Friend Forever. Um, yeah, also another change about version 1.4 is that Scootaloo can now apparently equip some stuff. She apparently was uh, very limited in previous versions. I don't have anything for her to equip right now though, so I guess I'll have to go back to the shop uh, while I wait for the pizza. And I'm probably gonna have to get rid of some of her equipment, because the bottle with rainbows, let's face it, it's probably not all that useful. Uh, I'm pretty sure this truck is supposed to not display a humanoid uh, thing right there, but it apparently is anyway, unfortunately. Huh, okay, Scootaloo can't equip any of this stuff. Well, can't afford any neighbor Scoots, so she's gonna be fighting naked for the time being. Is the pizza gonna get be here already? Uh, I guess I'll fast forward until it gets here. Or actually, no! We're gonna fight a signpost and a mad taxi. Oh my goodness, Scootaloo is really weak. Gonna have to make sure she stays alive. And for these two, I take their weak against Winter, maybe? Hopefully. Oh yeah, Scootaloo, one of her abilities is Mirror. It, it doesn't make much sense for her to have it. Or even Pooh comes in a bit, but... She can use it to make, make some uh, abilities of the enemies. I don't think this is a reliable uh, thing to select, so never do so. <laughs> and Scootaloo didn't even gain a level, and I think he's still paralyzed. Um. Guess I'm gonna have to go to the hospital to <laughs> restore Dinky. It's a nice touch, by the way, that uh, Dinky's uh, sprite is uh, slowly animated right now. Because she's paralyzed. I like these nice touches uh, on the overworld about how the characters currently are. You don't see that up very often in some games. Hey, doctor. I need help, doctor. Look at me. Not an illness? Are you serious? Well, I guess probably Zakor can uh, help me. Yes. Soften, restore feeling. Yep, so basically restore feeling restores, uh, well, heals us from paralysis. I'm guessing I need a uh, healing uh, gamma to get rid of paralysis otherwise. Van Hoover, huh? Uh, now I have to go to Van Hoover, not uh, the mis museum, but... I'm going to go to the museum anyway. Just as soon as the pizza gets here. I'm waiting for it. 
Just gonna fast forward to the video. Took you long enough! Pizza 5 ma'am, $238. He doesn't have a shadow. And I don't know why I look at the map. Yep, got a veggie pizza. Yep, 240 HP for everyone. Every pony. It's uh, not... A, some of our party members still don't have uh, over 200 HP, but still. Fully restoring everyone's HP, that can be a really good item at this point. It doesn't revive characters, though. Yeah, yeah, $3. I figure you know. Yeah, even though we're actually supposed to go to Van Hoover right now, there is something we can do up here, maybe. Hopefully. Yes, I do. So, yeah, we just gave our uh, <laughs> Wonderbolt signature to get in here. And for some reason, this guy uh, was uh, preventing us from entering this room because uh, the exhibit wasn't up yet. But he didn't mention anything about those uh, animated uh, sarcophaguses. So it's battle time. The mummy attacked. And it's actually got boss music. Huh. Better be careful then. And I'm guessing it's going to be weak against fire. Scoodaloo. You can put some shields up, can you? Yes, you can. I, uh, what sign is this again? Sigma. Yes, yeah, Sigma. Now everyone's protected. What are you gonna do, mummy? What about the paralysis? And it's got a present behind it. A mummy wrap. Ooh, it's a good thing I had that shield up, because otherwise Scootaloo would be down already. And I'm surprised this thing's not weak against anything. Maybe, hopefully it doesn't resist winters. Or winter, rather. It doesn't! So, I think this is pretty much a standard fair attack. It's just a really tough enemy at this point in the game. Really, really tough enemy. I think he's almost 45, and wow, that was disappointing. Scooter really needs those levels right now. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, Scooter she's gonna be getting lots of levels. And she's got a uh, mana magnet, much like uh, Sweetie Belle does. I'm actually surprised Dinky doesn't have a mana magnet. I thought she learned it. Anyway, another mummy. St same thing as before. Level 39 for Bell. That was 22 for Scootaloo. 23. But not 24, unfortunately. By the way, 24. That, that show is actually... Guy being uh, started again in a mini series. Maybe I should watch it. Then again, I haven't even watched the later season, so. Hmm. Swamp of Deep Darkness, huh? Only one with the hawk eye. And that's a secret code right there. <coughs> I guess I'm going to have to remember it. Uh, up, bottom left, right, left, bottom right. Hey, Scoots. Our ideology is cutie marks. Oh, okay, so now we can just uh, look at the hieroglyph uh, copy to uh, remember about the uh, passcode. Yeah, so basically, yeah, this is just uh, same thing as before. Let's just skip it. Anyway, we're going to need a Hawkeye item sometime later in the game. Hopefully we'll find it. That way we'll be able to go into Settle Arabia. And possibly go further into the game. I'm surprised there's nothing of relevance to uh, Flourishize uh, uh, element here. I think I'm already. I think I'm talking to this guy. Is what uh, continuing that plot thread though. 
So actually, yeah, lots of choices. I can go to Saddle Arabia or huh, phone. Guess I'll answer. Dusty bones. Yeah, okay, so now we can get Flutter Shy's element. Yeah, lots of choices. I can go to to uh, Dusty Bones Museum to do something, or I can go up to Van Hoover to continue whatever new possible plot thread uh, has happened there, or I can go directly to Salo Arabia. I'll probably, I'll probably get destroyed if I try that, but <laughs> it is a possible choice, I think. Well, you know what? I want to get Flutter Shy's element, so uh, I guess I'll go there. Uh, I probably should heal up first, though. I I'll heal up in uh, four side, whatever. Yeah, and now that we have lots of places to go to, we actually have quite a few choices. We can all go to Cloudsdale too, but we are not. We are going to Manhattan. I'm pretty sure you can do that with the basic teleport uh, ability, but. Uh, like, the, the way you are going in a circle, I, I'm pretty sure you can do that with the basic teleport ability. It's just that you have to have, have frame-perfect uh, abilities with your fingers. Anyway, now I have to heal and then I'm going to the museum. Fix the broken tube. Hungry HP sucker! Perfect! That's a, that's the better version of the HP sucker. Now, now Bloom has pretty much one of her better items to use. Because this works on all the enemies. Yes. Now, now Bloom can attack all the enemies at once, without uh, concern. Oh, oh. Zoiks. Yeah, it's gotta be made up. Them tabloids, they always try to be as alarmist and uh, sensational as possible. Anyway, going to the museum. The Dinosaur Museum. Someone should put more information about this in the wikia, the mother wikia, because it's kind of empty when it comes to the dinosaur museum. Fictional creatures, huh? Anyway, Dusty Bones, where are you? Not a lot of visitors here, only three people, or ponies. Hey! Exterminators? Oh right, rats. Hmm. I'll get rid of them. Hmm. You guys know what's in those sewers? Bones. Your bones. My bones. Bones, bones, bones. Actually, this is one of the more frustrating places to go through. Just because uh, the, the corridors are so tight. And Deadly Mouse. I'm guessing it's gonna do lots of smash attacks against us. But not always. Anyway, Scootaloo is a bit useless right now because she doesn't have a weapon or anything equipped, but uh, I'm not, I don't have the money to equip her with anything for the time being. So I'm just, oh wow, by seven? Jeez. So I'm gonna wait until I make a lot of money so that I can make Scootaloo more powerful. Would equip, equip, and buy her equipment when I have the money. Either that, or we're gonna get the equipment on the way, and that will do. Twenty-five. Ah, oh, that was disappointing. Especially after all the good level ups she had. Um, I think uh, we're yeah, we're supposed to go by here first. I went through this area before in my uh, Earth Round Halloween hack, and now broken iron, and Bloom was already has it. I wonder what it does. Yeah, she should be able to fix it at some point. Also, I never checked the mummy wrap. What does the mummy wrap do? Okay, so it's a uh, ca cause some damage to some enemies and possibly solidify them for one turn. Basically, a souped up handbag strap. Let's try it out against this filthy attack roach. Both to Bloom and Sweetie Belle. Did not work. Uh, 
Yeah, look at that damage uh, Scooter Lucan will do now. Although I'm guessing this Roach doesn't have much defense. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be well defended. Pretty sure there's nothing to the left, so we are going right. Can enemies spawn down here in the water? Or if that can be called water. I don't think they can. Because uh, if they can, like, uh, they'd have to be, like, the insects would have to be invisible. The mouse, like, you'd probably not be able to see anything about them. Yeah, I'm guessing there's no enemies that can ever spawn down here. Well, let's get rid of that insect. Bloom's level is 41. And that was disappointing. Always disappointing when it comes to Bloom. I don't know why. I guess I'm just unlucky with her. Only one mouse. Scoots level is 26! Yep, that trash can is an enemy. The stinky ghost! I'm guessing it resists our physical attacks, but I'm gonna attack with Dinky anyway, just to check it out. And I'm gonna have to bell cast a Winter Gamma. Yep. Or actually, no, it, since it was Scootaloo who attacked, I can't be sure. Well, it definitely... Uh, high defense is all around, it seems, but weaker against magic. By the way, have I mentioned that Scootaloo basically has no magic points? It kinda sucks. It makes sense, though, because she's supposed to be a Pexus, not a, an actual unicorn. Anyway, what is, what is in here? A broken spray can. Really? We're still getting some of those. They're kind of useless at this point. By the way, does Studio Bell seriously have max HP right now? Well, 168. Yes, yeah, Scootaloo, and she's only level 26, but she's already surpassed the amount of uh, max HP that Bell has. That's how low uh, Bell's uh, max HP is. And it's it's only going to be more apparent as uh, we continue the adventure that Sweetie Bell does not have a high max HP. Doesn't taste very good. I guess Bell's not a fan of uh, French food. You know what? Let's try out the Hungry HP Sucker. Of time I try to use it. And Scoots, you can just defend. Uh, I guess I won't see the Hungry HP Sucker, because, uh. Well, actually, no, but we'll see, but. There's only one enemy left, so. Well, it still worked. 63 HP for one enemy, too. Level 46 for Dinky. That, that was surprisingly good for a non uh, divisible by 4 level up. Mana Magnet Omega. And Brain Shock Alpha. I, I think Scootaloo is the only one who learns Brain Shock Alpha. Which makes no sense because she's a Pixis, but uh, again, the creator probably doesn't want to remove the magic attacks from uh, Pooh just because Scootaloo is not a unicorn. So he made some plot excuse that uh, Scootaloo can control the weather, which in turn allows her to ca to mic mic some spells. And yeah, there, are, there can be monsters down in the water, but probably only the trash cans. Bell's almost 40! Yep, that's a good level up. Offense up Omega. I, I haven't used the offense up and defense down very much. They're just not that great. I guess I might use them on Scooter Loot to make her keep up in some boss battles, though. Although Scooter Loot is not meant, not supposed to be. Yeah, even the never mind. Even the mouse can actually be an enemy down in the water. But I'm almost certain that there's never going to be an insect that can be fought while they're in the water. Level 28 for Scooter Loot. 
And that's a good level up. Yep. Now, I'm expecting an insect to be fought just about now. No? Oh, I guess not. Now we have to go all the way back there just to get that one treasure chest. Yep, the insects float in the water. That's what I wanted to mention. So yeah, there can be enemies down the water. All of them. No exceptions. Treasure chest... Uh, not a treasure chest, a garbage can. And the garbage cans, the real garbage cans, are... They're, they're, they're slightly different color from the actual enemy garbage cans. And all there is in here is a butterfly, which is actually pretty useful uh, right now. Could use some of that uh, magic point restoring magic right now. Yep, only 39 magic points for Scootaloo. Not very much. Uh, another change that happened in version 1.4 is that uh, Sweetie Belle no longer flips when we're moving horizontally. Uh, in fact, I think most of the sprite flipping has been fixed now. Even I haven't even noticed Apple Bloom flipping either. What's in here? A broken cannon. So that's for... Bloom. Yeah, anything else that's broken that's on... Nope. So we're, the Rust Promoter DX, uh, what, we're, what are we going to use that on? I can't, I can't be certain. And wow! Four mice at once! This, this is going to be dangerous. Better not fool around. Hungry HP sucker, go. And Scootaloo, protect all of us. Oh, just missed. <laughs> and now they're all dead. <coughs> or... Most of them. Nope, only one of them. Oh, goodness! This is what I was concerned about. Hungry HP Sucker! Defeat them all! Oh, uh, no, actually. The first one's not gonna die, but... Okay, only one left. But, Sweetie Bell's down, which means we now have to use... Uh, I think, uh, Scootaloo has the healing item. Yep, yeah, Scootaloo has the Cup of Life Noodles. I think Belle has the other cup, cup of Life Noodles. Okay, just finish off the last one. There we go. Managed to get defeat uh, them all, and all, all the ponies on our team are going to get the experience. Uh, yeah, we were just up there, and now we have to go back down here and continue on with this pretty crappy dungeon. I don't get what's with uh, some game designers thinking, uh, also high flourish, I, I don't get why some of the game designers think uh, we, did, we should always have a, some type of sewer level. They're generally always nasty to play in, if not for the atmosphere or the aesthetics, but merely for the fact that they're just, uh, well... Game, designer, game designers don't seem to be aware of what the sewers are filled with. <laughs> Just gonna say that right now. Also, Fleshy, what do you want? Why are you standing in front of us? I thought you were j back in the monkey uh, hive. No, you aren't supposed to be here. Uh, well, actually, it is okay with us if we leave. And it isn't very safe here, but... You know, you're blocking the exit, Fluttershy, so please move out of the way. Stay. Get rid of us our, our, yourself? Whoa! She... <laughs> um, her head looks really weird. Like, it looks too small compared to her body. But then again, if, if you were to make her head any bigger than it is right now, she'd look even weirder. So it's probably the body that needs to be smaller. Anyway, Fluttershy, she probably, uh, if I recall, uh, she replaces the Plague Rat of Doom. So let's paralyze her. 
Bell will try to freeze her, and Bloom will spy on her, and Scootaloo put our shields up, because, uh, defense. Uh, kind of resists cold, but uh, winter is still kind of effective. 71. She's not very, she's got lots of defenses. And she can't be paralyzed. And she was guarding. Uh, she must be a defensive fighter, I bet. Let's try to hypnotize her. It's, it should work on her. Maybe 10% chance of uh, succeeding, I bet. I wouldn't be surprised. And let's actually bring her defense down, because she's got such high defensive power. And, uh, yeah, hungry HP sucker for Bloom for the rest of the game. <laughs> uh, no, what? Let's use the ball of rainbows on Scootaloo, to, just to demonstrate what it does. Yeah, see, it doesn't restore much of uh, Scootaloo's magic. Then again, Scoo doesn't have a very high magic power maximum. So it doesn't happen very often that you, you will use uh, the other magic point restoring items on her. Um, sudden Gut Spill on Bloom, because HP Sucker probably won't work on uh, Flourish Eye. And uh, Magic Truffle for Belle, because she's running out of magic power. Uh, Scootaloo. You know what? Try to mirror Scoot uh, Flourish Eye's action. No, she could not. Probably because uh, it's a fake. Ah, uh, no smash. Oh goodness, now there's a deadly mouse. That's uh, kind of hard to see. <laughs> you can barely see it flash when I select it right here, but yeah. Flourish Eye's sprite is kind of big. <laughs> Friendship beta go. And, you know what? Let's try Storm. And... Just uh, bash Flourish Eye repeatedly, Bloom. And, you know what? Let's try Mana Magnet. Omega. There's no reason to ever use Mana Magnet Alpha once you get Magna Man Magnet Omega. Because they both cost nothing to cast. No one came. Oh goodness. Well, the shield kind of helped. Uh, more friendship beta. Winter Omega, or rather Gamma. Uh, let's try Hungry HP Sucker again. No, actually no, Bl Bloom is supposed to bash because she's got the high cuts. And Scootaloo, you are going to cast Shield Beta on Dinky because her shield's gone. So she can use a replacement now, and she's going to get the powerful version of it. And now Flush has been solidified. Really, Bloom? No smash attacks. And the Deadly Mouse is now tame. This isn't that difficult of a boss fight, but I did get extremely lucky with the Applejack one, so maybe I'm getting lucky with this one too. It also helps that since I have so many uh, spells and abilities I can use now, I have a lot more control over how the battle uh, like uh, goes. Compare that to the beginning where you're basically just limited to attack, heal, and defend. Yeah, this is why I didn't want to generally attack with Scootaloo. Oh, Mighty Bear 7? Well, Flush Eye has the ability to call quite a few animal friends to her rescue. Unfortunately, the Mighty Bear 7 is not that much of a threat. Uh, no, ah, uh, damn it, she can't cast it. Well, actually, just drain some more Magicka from Flourish High Scootaloo. Then she'll, ca she'll try to cast a Brain Shock Alpha on Flourish High next turn. Assuming we don't defeat her all right away. No, Flourish High has a lot of HP, wow. And she never attacks herself, she only calls for help. That's kind of a nice touch, to be honest. And now it's a fight. Considering that uh, Bloom never managed to get a smash stack on uh, Flourish Eye, I'm gonna assume it's impossible and just use the Hungry HP Sucker from now on. 
And you are going to try to use Brain Shock Alpha on Fluttershy. Unless I defeat her right here. Yeah, so much for trying Brain Shock Alpha on uh, Fluttershy. And 31,000. I think he's level 47. Good level up. 41 for Bale. Loom 42. And Skulu is 30. And then 31. 32 maybe? No, no 32. Well, that was Changeling Fluttershy. Where she's gone now. Hopefully the real one's still alive and hasn't been captured or anything. And finally we get Flourishai's element. That's the element of kindness. And uh, since it's a new element, let's just listen to the dormant element. Yet again. I always hate it when the, we just uh, the, the song just kind of ends because we're missing some elements, but it happens. Anyway, that leaves us with only three elements, and really, interrupting me uh, right now. Who are you, Miss Dinky? Oh, Raven. Oh, Princess Celestia has. Oh, we we can speak to Celestia now. And another phone call. Bonbon. New treat. Well, that wasn't expected. You know what? That gives us a lot of choices on what I should do next video. We can go see Bon Bon first, or go see Princess Lestia first, or go up to Van Hoover to see what's bothering Pinkie Pie, or go directly to Saddle Arabia and get murdered by a whole world dragon, because I'm probably not leveled enough to handle it right now. It's up to you guys on what I should try first. So vote away in the comments section below on what, where I should get destroyed. Or hopefully rather just visit Bon Bon for some... Tasty magic caramels or whatever she has prepared. So, hope you've all enjoyed this video and hope y'all have a very nice day. See you next time. Bye-bye.